Hello, I'm Professor Phileas B. Baxter, and if you're watching this, you have been recruited to the top secret United States government Centaurus project. It could also be the case that this film has fallen into your hands accidentally. If so, please turn off the projector, swallow the film and firmly bite your tongue until dead. Thank you. As you well know, the Centaurus project has been designed with the intention of creating an elite diplomatic corps to represent us on other planets. And you will make up that core. In this course, these educational films will teach you teleportation, how to interact with alien species, and other things whose dubious legality we have avoided by hiding ourselves in an underground base in the middle of the desert. You may also choose optional credits for the Minotaur project to eliminate Fidel Castro or Project Gorgon, mind expansion through the consumption of LSD. But be careful, experience has shown us that conducting these two projects simultaneously is inadvisable. Let us move on then to the first lesson. To travel to other planets we will be using the system of teleportation. That is, the process of transporting objects from one place to another instantaneously. It's more expensive than spaceships, but some rather unpleasant incidents involving space cannibalism have convinced us of its convenience on long trips. Let's see the teleporter in action. Remember that before teleportation, you should check that the battery has been charged. The battery could go dead in the middle of the process, and the sending of severed limbs to other planets would not offer us any diplomatic advantages. It's also important to undergo teleportation after fasting. If the machine were to confuse your molecules with those of food, it could lead to the creation of an aberrant half-man, half-ham sandwich being. Or half-chicken, if you're Jewish. Anyway, let's proceed without further delay to the teleportation. And remember, the future is like hot food. We must never let it fall into the hands of the communists. <laughs> 